Good afternoon, everyone. Lovely to see you. Hope you're all having a good week. And uh, here in Bristol, while the clouds have opened, we've just had a huge downpour, even a tiny rumble of thunder. So if you hear any massive weather disruption going on, welcome to Bristol in July. Tell you what, it beats that heat wave earlier on this week. I hope you're all keeping well. Hello to everyone. Whatever time of day it is, wherever you are in the world, you are all so welcome at Home Choir. Now, I'm here a little bit earlier, perhaps, than I normally would be, because the sound checks today are particularly important, because we're going to be playing you some of the very early quarantine choir tracks. I mean, literally, the, the first few. Uh, you're going to see as somebody, Christine, rather, rather interestingly said, young Ben. I mean, from two and a half years ago. If you th <laughs> I suppose younger, Ben, uh, and to say the, the toll of lockdown, Messiah, home choir, cry of the earth, I'm not sure it's taken that much of a toll on me, but at the same time, yes, technically speaking, younger Ben. And what I want to make sure is, everyone, that the video uh, and my sound matches up. So this needs to be a slightly longer sound check, and I'm going to be watching along on my phone and stopping every now and then to check, just be certain that it is synced, because it is actually a really complicated arrangement here to make this happen. You'd think it would be easy, but it's not. So just bear with me. I'm going to give you a little bit of a blast of some of these, <laughs> some of these tracks. Have we aged you then, Ben? No comment, Emma. But yeah, here we go. Here's I'm going to sing, and this is just a little taster to check that we can sync together. Here we go. But I'm going to sing, 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 and let's see how we do. Yeah, right, definitely everybody. more youthful. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three. I'm going to sing, sing, sing. I'm going to dance, dance, dance. I'm going to sing. I'm going to dance. Hallelujah. When the gates are open wide, I'll be standing by your side. I'm going to sing. I'm going to dance. Hallelujah. I'm going to sing. Okay. Sing. Let's just check that. Goodness me, you have no idea, folks, how long it's taken me to get that to sync up. You have no idea, but I'm going to tell you, three hours, an hour and a half last night and an hour and a half today to get that to sync. Let's see, just hope it works across the board. Here's a bit of Un Poquito Cantas. Here we go. Come straight in. Have fun. Here we go. Un Poquito Cantas. Un Poquito There we are. Gosh, you look different, Ben. Yes, the years have not been kind. Let's just listen to that. Let's just check that that was all in time. Do you like the canary? Like the ooh. Okay, I think we can get away with that. Phew. Honestly. <laughs> The effort that's gone into making these videos sync up. you think it would be a simple button, but it just ain't. Ben, you're a bit pay... Yeah, well, a lot of that's down to the lighting, everyone. In that I had no lights. I had a completely rubbish camera. What was I recording? I think I was recording those early ones on my phone. Epi says, I bet Ben in 22 would have taken six hours. I, I, that's a really good point, Epi. I, I couldn't get it to work. That's the point. I would have been singing along with videos of myself for the last two years if I could have. It would be great to put them up on screen, press a button and sing along. Haven't been able to get it to work, which is why this is the first time this has happened. But I thought there must be a way to get it to work. There has to be. Turns out there was, but it took three hours. Cheers, everyone. Fabulous to see you all. Now I've got a bit of time to welcome everyone. Let me just double check. Let's put these headphones down here. That's the listening to the video and singing along headphones. And this is to hear what you're hearing through my main microphone here. Marvellous. Good, that sounds all right. Um, we've got that. Oh, they still loaded up with a Guno. I do hope you enjoyed loading that Guno the other day. It's lush, isn't it? 
And just to say, I'm working hard behind the scenes to get that Ave Maria ready for Sunday. I've got the tenors, the basses, and the altos wrangled. It's just the small matter of that melody. Sopranos, we need to do a little bit of work together on that over the next day or so. But by Sunday morning, you will sound absolutely stunning. And uh, really looking forward to you hearing it. It's really gorgeous. It's a lovely, lovely version. Uh, now, everyone who is here, I wish you a very, very good afternoon or good morning or good, good evening, whatever time of day it is where you are. And let's see who have we got. Lots of lovely people. Well, let me start, as always, by thanking everyone for watching today. Quite a few people catch up with us later on. So hello to Mags, hello to Robert, hello to Terry, hello to Chris, hello to everyone who's been leaving us messages in the comments because they haven't been able to join us live and I just do hope you're enjoying the sessions. Uh, special hello to Hu Yen who can't always make it live but is always here so thank you to you. Hello to everyone who's watching live but isn't necessarily in the chat. Hello as always to Helen and Bill, good morning folks. Hello to Val, hello to Sally and Annie and Maureen and Sue and Tony, hello to Anne and Linda. Hello to Nikki and Charlotte. Hello to Katie in Thornbury. And uh, there we are. It's wonderful to see all of you and everyone who is here this afternoon for Fun Friday. I mean, what a great time of the week. Friday afternoon. So hello to Alison. Hello to Barbara. Hello, Carol. Hello, Carolyn. Hello to Christine. Hello, Christine. Hello, Elizabeth. Hello, Emma. Hello, Fiona. Hello, Gaynor. Hello, Jill. Hello, Epi. Hello, Jackie. All the best to Gwen. Hello, Jean. Hello, Jen. Hello, Jill. Hello, Kit Kat. Hello, Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Hello, Lorraine. Hello, Marie. Hello, Michael. Hello, Nicola. Hello, Nina. Hello, Norb. Hello, Ruth. Hello, Sue. Hello, Susanna. Hello, Terry. All right. Great to see you all today. And I'm hoping Carla will be along in a bit because it's her birthday today. We will sing happy birthday. So there's Nikki. Hello, Nikki. Good afternoon to you. And uh, anyone who was with me during the Choir of the Earth soprano rehearsal this morning, Another epic, epic session. Two hour rehearsals for Choir of the Earth at the moment for this big, big mass of life. Um, it, it is the biggest thing we've rehearsed. It really is some of the longest sessions I've ever done in this online format. But my goodness me, what a piece. It's absolutely phenomenal. Uh, if you're not part of the course, do consider having a listen to it. Just put Delius Mass of Life. If you include the word score, after that as well, you can see a rather nice video, an animated score version, um, which is the version conducted by David Hill, who's a very nice chap. And uh, that it's an incredible piece, absolutely mind-blowing. It'll take a few listens in, in the pure Mark Strawn tradition of got to listen to it ten times. It really will take a few listens, but my goodness, it's fabulous. So how's everyone doing in the comments? Hello, Patricia. Good afternoon to you. Thank you for your lovely comments. Uh, Jill's got Cry of the Earth with Jaws. We can still join Jill. Honestly, it's so good. It really is brilliant. Uh, hello to Hanu. Hello, Soraya. Good to see you. Kit Kat saying there will be a Zoom session straight after me and then a rest until the choir session. Oh, that's brilliant. I'm afraid I won't be able to join because after this, I timestamp the videos. As soon as we've finished, I put all of those little timestamps. I hope you've noticed that on the more recent videos, the last few months, when you come back later on, you have the option of jumping straight to a song. It does take a few minutes to put that in. So I won't be able to come and join you in the Zoom, but I do hope you all have a lovely time, those of you who are meeting on Zoom. Hi, Nina. Lovely to see you. And Susanna's saying the weather's not great. Well, yeah, it's it's not as good uh, as, as it was earlier this week. Actually, I'd prefer it this temperature. Low 20s, pouring with rain. Perfect for Bristol in the summer. Uh, superb. So people are packing. Jill, you're packing. Oh, is it to, to Birmingham? <gasps> Commonwealth Games. Oh, fantastic. Hope you have a fantastic time, Jill. I really do. Do um, send us some pictures and uh, and we'll, we'll uh, see if we can spot you on the telly. Fabulous. Great stuff. I'm glad you like the timestamps, everyone. That's brilliant. It's it's worth doing. It really is. It's It's a long, long session otherwise. And you'll see the early quarantine choir videos, the early uh, online choir videos that I put up back in March of 2020 were absolutely tiny compared to this. Mind you, they took a lot of time to put together. Um, for those of you who weren't around in those early days of quarantine choir, before we became home choir, before I started streaming live, 
uh, you can watch all of those videos. I've put links in the description today to the actual videos that these extracts came from. I'm not going to play the full videos. Some of them are sort of six minutes, some are ten. As, it, as I went on, um, they got more and more elaborate. Um, but I have links to all of the original videos. So if you haven't seen them, you can go back and watch. As Christine said, young Ben, technically true, um, deliver a whole load of sessions in lockdown without a live audience. And I really did put a lot of time into those videos. It was very much a matter of kind of creating this whole idea, this idea of you can take a rehearsal in a room with nobody there as long as you're talking into the camera, as long as you're projecting what you want the people to do, they will sing for you. Uh, I don't think anyone had quite made music like this before. So we were doing it in a new way. And uh, yeah, it took some time. So Susanna says, hot concert night, 29 degrees. Oh, that is going to be hot. I think, yeah, bare feet, Susanna, bare feet. Cheers. 12th of March, 2020, a long time ago. Indeed, Kit Kat, a lot of water has gone under the bridge. And Terry said, what a lot you and we have learned in the past two years. You are not wrong. Think about how many of you used YouTube at all during your daily lives. How many of you knew how to comment? How many of you knew how to leave emojis? I bet there'd be very few of you who'd say, yes, I did. But of course, you all learnt very quickly. And uh, now imagine, just think about how many, I, I wonder seriously, how many of you have, as a result of this choir and uh, other choirs, to name none others, um, Choir of the Earth, for example, um, have bought YouTube Premium because of all of the adverts? I never would have thought of, of buying YouTube Premium um, but we've got got to the point where it's part of my work. I have to have it or it just is interminable. I know many of you have done that. I appreciate it is expensive, but my goodness me, the adverts are a pain, aren't they? Um, who else is here? It's lovely to see so many. Hello to Jill. Good afternoon, Jill. Hello, Stuart. Wrestling with bread dough. Ooh, do you know what? I really do with making some bread later on. I think I've said everyone, I actually have a couple of qualifications in baking. From before I went to university, I was a Saturday boy at a local bakery in Romford. That involved getting up at three o'clock in the morning, everyone, and going to start work back in those days. And um, I did a couple of NVQs in um, food preparation, and particularly in working with bread. So you've got me, you've got me inspired, Stuart. I think I'm going to make some bread later on. Anyway, everyone, it is great to see you all. I do hope you're all having a good day. Thanks for being here. We are going to take a little journey back in time together. But before that, I'm going to invite you all to make sure you have a drink handy. Make sure if you are here live that you enjoy the live chat. Although if it's not for you, you can get rid of it, of course, with a click. And if you're watching later on, do consider giving us a comment below the video because it all helps YouTube. Well, it helps YouTube know that we are a popular choir. Um, also, do consider giving us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so because um, we love to see that as well. So I'm going to give you a chord, everyone. Let's have that nice C9 chord. And we'll sing Home Choir together. Are we ready, everyone? Here we go. Home. Oh, gorgeous stuff. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Thank you so much, everyone, and a very, very good afternoon to you. Welcome to Fun Friday. It's that time of the week where we can just kick back, relax, enjoy ourselves. We've made it to the end of another week. Those of us in the UK, we've had a pretty full-on week. There's a lot going on uh, in terms of our news at the moment, after the heat wave in particular this week. And I know that all around the world, there's a lot going on as well. So everyone, just take a nice deep breath and sigh. Ah. <sighs> It's this lovely feeling when you get to Friday afternoon that, you know what, that's a that's another week ticked off. I've done lots. I've achieved a lot. It's now time to relax. And this week, we definitely deserve it. And what we're going to do, folks, is we're going to take, look at that. There he is. We're going to take a trip back in time to the very, very start of this channel, to Quarantine Choir. And you might be thinking, but aren't we home choir? Well, Anna and I between us came up with the names Home Choir and Quarantine Choir way, way back in February of 2020. In fact, we came up with Home Choir in January of 2020 as an idea to just set up as something that people might want to do. Quarantine Choir came as a result of us seeing this looming pandemic and thinking, hmm, this looks a little bit worrisome. 
perhaps we should start thinking about how people are going to sing if we have to go into lockdown. And we like the name so much, we registered Home Choir as the channel, and then we ran Quarantine Choir for several months in 2020. It actually came back later in 2020 when we all went back into lockdown. So a little bit of history. And in the very early days, we were not streaming live, everyone. I was recording all the videos using a standalone camera and tripod and lights and microphones, and it was all extraordinarily complicated and took hours and hours and hours because I was a bit of a perfectionist. Um, and then, of course, along came this opportunity to work with the Self-Isolation Choir, who are now Choir of the Earth, and I just didn't have the time to produce standalone videos, so I started live streaming, and here we all are. That's the origins of this choir. And to celebrate that, as it's been over two and a half years now, uh, we're going to have a little selection from the early days of Quarantine Choir. And I was just saying, all the videos that these extracts have come from, starring younger me, are in the description. If you want to watch them after that, there are about 14, 15, 16 videos from those early days. There's even an outtakes video, which I have to say is worth watching. Um, but they're all standalone videos. None of them are live streams. And uh, they're all a bit different. So do enjoy those. Now, before we crack on with the programme today, let me remind you what we've got coming up for the rest of the week. Join me on Sunday morning at 11am UK time for a two Ave Marias. Not one, but two. The Guno, which we learned just a couple of days ago, and then your performance, everyone, of the Schubert Ave Maria, which we recorded as part of a Sing and Send a few weeks ago. It's sounding fantastic. So looking forward to sharing that with you on Sunday morning. We'll also sing some lovely Bach, the first movement of Jesu Meine Freude. Fabulous music. There'll be a couple of gospel songs in there as well, of course. And then next week, it's the last week of term, effectively. Remember, we are off uh, live streams, at least, for August, but more on that in a minute. So we're going to have a Folk Monday end of term special. We will have a Sing and Send on Wednesday. We've got some lovely Purcell, O Sing Unto the Lord. Uh, that's O Worship the Lord, I should say, from O Sing Unto the Lord. And then Fun Friday, we'll have an end of term uh, shindig. And then Sing Sunday, well, we're going to have a Handle Fest on that day. Now, remember, during August, we're not here, but we're rerunning old episodes of Home Choir at the usual times, two o'clock on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and 11 o'clock on Sunday. Lots of you have voted already. The closing date for that is coming up. It's tomorrow. So if you haven't voted, the details, of course, are in the newsletter. Please do let us know your favourite Home Choir episodes, and the winners of that will be announced early next week, and that will form your programme for August. So remember, all the details are in the newsletter. Please sign up. It's free, and it's got everything you need to be in Home Choir. OK, everyone. Now then. Let's get started with a warm-up. Can I invite you all to stand up for me? Be upstanding. Do you know, I miss, I'm just thinking I missed a trick. I should have grabbed one of the early warm-ups starring young Ben and warmed up with that. Well, next time, next time. Let's start by taking a nice deep breath and sigh. <sighs> Fabulous. Hello to Christine. Lovely to see you. Thanks for joining us. Hello, Mary. Hello, Sarah. Just roll your shoulders around, everyone. It is great to see you. And roll your shoulders back the other way. Oh, good stuff. Hello, Jackie. Lovely to see you as well. Bring your shoulders up to your ears, everyone. And breathe out. Let your shoulders relax and sigh. Lovely. Just stretch your neck muscles. Just gently roll the head around. Well done, everyone. Fantastic. OK, let's just sing some nice shapes up and down. We do have a birthday to celebrate in a minute. Oh, just sing to ma, 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 ma. Here we go. Ma, 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 ma. Ma, 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 ya. Ya, 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 ya. And again. Ya, 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 ya. Yo. Yo, 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 yo. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Me. Me, 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 me. And again. Me, 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 me. And ya. Ya, ya, ya. Indeed, that will do for our session today. Not going any higher than that. But we are going to sing happy birthday to dear Carla, who is celebrating her birthday today. We do have a couple more birthdays. We're going to sing happy birthday on Sunday to Wendy and to Breda. But today, we're going to celebrate Carla's birthday. So, everyone, after two, one, two. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Carla. Many, many happy returns.
returns to you. Now, everyone, we're going to make a start with our Quarantine Choir Revisited session. And uh, what you're going to hear is a very different style of delivery, but I think at the heart it is all very much the same thing. It's me talking into the camera, leading the music, just without all these bells and whistles and buttons and lights and so on. It's very much uh, toe-in-the-water stuff. I had no idea, absolutely no idea, where this was all going to lead. Now, the first piece is called I'm Gonna Sing, Sing, Sing. And I think most of us know this one. We've sung it before. If you haven't, you can watch the video from March 2020, where I taught it and learn it. But this is a great piece for getting everyone singing together, regardless of whether they have singing experience, because you sing the main tune, or you can sing Swing Low Sweet Chariot, or you can sing When the Saints Go Marching In, or as we've since discovered, This Train Is Bound For Glory, or even Amazing Grace. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna sing along with me from the 12th of March, 2020. That's the very first broadcast on this channel, my very first online rehearsal. So you'll see me pop up in my nice brown shirt and we'll sing together. So here is I'm going to sing, sing, sing with me from 2020. Start with I'm going to sing, sing, sing and let's see how we do. All right, Ready? everybody. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three. I'm, I'm going to sing, sing, sing. sing. I'm, I'm going to dance, dance, dance. I'm going to sing. sing. I'm going to dance. Hallelujah. When the gates are open wide, I'll be standing by your side. I'm going to sing, I'm going to dance, hallelujah. Swing low, swing low, sweet chariot. Come and fall to carry me home. Swing low, sweet chariot. Come and fall to carry me home. When the saints go marching, when the saints go marching in. Oh, when the saints go marching in, I wanna be in that number. When the saints go marching in, I'm gonna this train is bound for glory. This train is bound for glory. This train is bound for glory. When the gates are open wide, glory is nobody rides it but the righteous and the holy. I'm gonna sing. This train is bound for glory. This train. Fantastic, everybody! Give yourselves a huge round of applause. Thank you very much indeed. Now, 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 what I was about to say is, I'll be back tomorrow. This was one of those uh, one of those projects where I thought I'll do it every day. It'll only take me 10 minutes a day. And so the first few weeks we were on every single day, Monday to Sunday. And my goodness me, what a journey that was. Now, the second day of quarantine, quite let's go back full screen, otherwise I'm in a box. The second day was the Friday, Friday, the 13th of March. And uh, I thought, how am I going to follow that? How can I improve on perfection? Well, one of the things people said, and bear in mind, we had a total, everyone, at that point, of eight subscribers after that first day. But people said, could we have the words on screen? How am I going to do that? So I thought, right, I'll use iMovie and I'll add the words on screen. So the next song is the Eriske Love Lilt, as taught to me by the lovely people of Audley Redwood, where I used to run a choir. And the words are on screen for this one. So let's sing along with me from the 13th of March, 2020 with the Eriske Love Lilt. Here we go. All right, so stand up nice and tall. And I'll give camera you angle. an introduction, here we go. Oh, 
ladies and gentlemen thank you for your lovely singing and thank you for your time today i hope if you've made it this far through the video that you've enjoyed it please share this with anybody you think listen to the man a bit of singing i'll be back tomorrow with some more <laughs> songs but in the meantime be well and i'll see you soon. see you soon there we are listen to the man he knows what he's talking about gorgeous song uh, and the, the, this was, you could see the broadcast was evolving day by day. I said again, I'll be back tomorrow. And I was. We were back the next day with the Erie Canal. Different camera angle, still with the words on screen. Um, but this time I spent a bit longer. We had a bit of a warm up on that session. And I was starting to give people a bit of advice because I was starting to get feedback. People saying, we really like this. Could we have a bit more? So let's have the Erie Canal. This is from the 14th of March 2020 and this is one of the last times the last days where I actually left the house for several weeks after that so this is Erie Canal from the 14th of March 2020 here we go uh, if you can watch yourself in the mirror try and try and have different facial expressions oh, as different you go facial expressions. The minor bits it's all very well to look serious but when we get to the lighter sections about the low bridge and you'll always know your neighbour, you'll always know your pal. Let's get those cheeks up here, let's Big get smiles. that lovely smile. All right, everybody, so from the very beginning, here we here's go. your introduction. Here we go now. I got a mule, her name is Sal. I got a mule, her name is Sal. Fifteen miles on the Erie Canal. She's a good old worker, she's a good old pal. Okay, so if you have the words below, please make sure you've got them ready. Okay, this is the one that starts, get up there, Sal, we've passed that lock. Ready, and get up there, Sal, we've passed that lock. Fifteen miles on the Erie Canal, and we'll make Rome before six o'clock. Fifteen miles on the Erie Canal, a friend of mine once got Sal saw. On to Buffalo, Low Bridge, everybody down. Low Bridge, just we're coming to a town, and you'll always know your neighbor, you'll always know your pal if you've ever navigated on the Erie Canal. Well, fabulous! Done. Can you give yourselves a round of applause and a round of applause for everybody else who's singing along at the moment. Brilliant. Well sung, everyone. Well, you can see things were slowly but surely developing. I've worked out the camera angles. It's better to have uh, to be able to face the camera when I was playing, at least slightly, rather than looking across. The words were on screen and uh, things were starting to pick up. We had 25 subscribers when I made that video. I was thinking, my goodness, this is this is really going somewhere. Now, the next morning was Sunday the 15th of March. I had actually conducted a concert the night before. The Nelsie Concert Orchestra had performed Beethoven's Sixth Symphony and it was a really very emotional experience because of course we all knew that this horrible virus was looming. We didn't know what was around the corner. Um, so I got up that Sunday morning and I, I had plugged the choir to the audience the day before and I went to my computer and I clicked on uh, the uh, YouTube and I saw 
we had 40 subscribers. <gasps> It was a real moment. I was absolutely thrilled. So I recorded one of my favourite songs. I thought, I'll get the guitar out. Let's do something different. And so we did Unbuckie the Kansas. Let's sing that one. Here we go. Come straight in. Have fun. Here we go. Like, that share, and subscribe. The subscribe button. Uh, and if you've already Listen done that, to the man. thank you. You're a member of the choir. Ever so grateful for Fabulous. you joining. Uh, do consider sending it to somebody you think might benefit from a bit of singing at home. I'll be back tomorrow with more fun and games. I'll be back meantime, tomorrow. That's the be thing. Well, and I'll every see you soon. day, every day, everyone. Gosh. And by this point, you can see I was starting to have some fun. You might have spotted a couple of little graphics in there. Did you spot the canary? It's subtle, but it was there. And the ole at the end, I thought, well, if we're going to do this, we're going to have some fun. Uh, Atty's saying, I love the haircut. This is the thing, Atty. What haircut? I needed a haircut in March 2020. How many of you were like me? Thought, I'll put it off till next week and then ended up in lockdown and ended up with long flowing locks. It's a very, very different time, everyone, wasn't it? Now, at this point... We it, it just exploded. We went from 40 subscribers to 200 the next day to 400 the next day to 500 by the middle of the week. I started getting phone calls from journalists, from the BBC, from all sorts of people going, I understand you're running a choir in lockdown. And I started spending literally hours on the phone. This is absolutely true to all sorts of people from newspapers and radio stations who wanted to talk to me about this because everyone at that point was in lockdown by that by the tuesday of that week um and so i started really throwing everything at this uh, this idea now later that week uh, i've skipped a couple of sessions late that week i put out a little video of a bernstein piece that i remembered from my youth choir days called do bing do bang do bong and at this point folks i think it's fair to say that lockdown was starting to get to me a little bit so let's have a bit of do bing do bang do bong from the middle of that first week of lockdown this will have been around about fifth no hang on let's get right 17th or 18th of march 2020 here we go i thought this was a good idea at the time do bing do bang do Bong, do bing, do bang, do bong. Do be ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Do be ding a dee bing, ding a dee bang, ding a dee bong. Have you seen this in Canada? Do bing, do bang, do bong, do bing, do bang, do bong. 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 
Bernstein. As I say, folks, I think lockdown was starting to get to me. I haven't included the puppet video in this one. And Dorothy knows just what it takes to be a puppeteer. It was quite a time. And lots of people are talking in the comments about how lonely it was, how scary it was. And I felt that too. I really did. But I was very much inspired. I was buoyed by the enthusiasm, by the passion of the people who started following this choir. We got to a thousand subscribers on this channel after a little over a week. It was just unbelievable. People from all over the world. I was expecting a few people from the West Country of the UK to come and join me. And I started getting messages from the USA, from Canada, from Australia, from the Middle East, from Japan, from Singapore, from mainland Europe, from all over the world, from South America as well. People just going, we're trapped indoors as well. We love what you do. And it was just the greatest inspiration for me to keep producing these videos. I started throwing everything at them. I was spending 10 hours, 11 hours every day producing a 20 minute video and I loved doing it but it was exhausting. So what you're going to see is two videos from towards the end of this intensive period where I was just coming up with the format of the choir and we're going to have great day. Now we've sung this one since in a close harmony version but this one, I don't mind telling you folks, this particular video was this was the moment I realised I was probably working a bit too hard because this great day took 30 takes to record. 3-0. 30. More on that in a minute. Here's great day. Right, folks, here we go. I also lost some weight, as you can see. <laughs> here we go. Great. Now, what I go on to say in that video, I go on to talk about how many takes it took to record it. And I mentioned an outtakes video, which you can find if you search Home Choir, you put outtakes, Home Choir outtakes, you can see it. If I'm honest, it's very boring. Nobody in their right mind will want to watch a video of me making a fool of myself 
please no 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 don't don't watch it don't worry about it it's fine just just leave it it's uh, it's not of any interest to anyone now i'm going to show you the last video for today this is the breakfast song and many of you will remember this one this was the last time i recorded a uh, one of these standalone videos before i spoke to a certain chap called mark strawn i recorded this as soon as i finished recording it i put it up and then I had a conversation which would change my life and would change many of the lives of the people watching at the moment. Of course, as a result of this conversation with Mark, the entire format of this choir changed because I needed to have time to stream live. I learned how to stream live and really the rest is history. So the breakfast song, it's a tiny little piece, really, a little amuse-bouche. But uh, in terms of the history of this channel, it was a really important day. So I hope you've enjoyed this little journey back, little sojourn through history. Do consider having a look at some of the early quarantine choir videos. They were all made with a huge amount of love for everyone, not just for those who were coming along. I didn't know who was coming along. I didn't know any of you at that point. I just knew there were people out there who wanted to sing, sing, sing. And that's what we did. Now I'm going to play along with my little ukulele. Please do consider joining in. You need C, F and G for this one. And here is the breakfast song. Now you can also see at this point how tired I am because there were quite a few mistakes. <laughs> I take the first verse. When I start the second verse, you start the second, start the first verse yourself. That's not right then. Confused myself. Yep. I'll start again, shall I, folks? Good idea. I'll start the first verse. I'll sing it all the way through. You start the first verse when I start the second verse, and we sing those all the way through. And then your friend, colleague, partner, person who was just passing by and can sing in through the window can start that first verse when you start the second verse and I start the third verse and we get three parts. You, you're following me. Okay, so three <laughs> levels of involvement. You decide what you want to do. And of course, as it's YouTube, you could always come back tomorrow and do a different level. Okay, so like to can I invite you all, ladies and gentlemen, to be upstanding, plant your feet, your shoulders to be apart. Upstanding, wherever Make I heard your that knees nice and soft. Make your back long uh, and your neck long as well. Okay, nice straight back, a nice long neck. And take a nice deep, tall breath in. Blow it out, one more nice deep breath. Blow it out, okay, let's sing the song, okay? Off we go. When it's time for breakfast, I like toast and marmalade. Wait, the wrong no, board. that's absolutely right. <laughs> uh, hello, outtakes oh, video. Oh dear, okay. Well done, so let's one. sing the song all the way through. And when it's time for breakfast, I like toast and marmalade, toast and marmalade. Toast and marmalade When it's time for breakfast I like toast and marmalade That's how I start my day When it's time for breakfast I like toast and marmalade for me Toast and marmalade That's enough for me With milk and sugar When it's time for breakfast I like toast and marmalade That's enough for me Just a cup of tea that's it, and a slice me. of so that's it, and bread. bread with milk and sugar. If just you have, have no bacon, that's it, and a sausage will do instead. I like bacon, 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 when it's time for breakfast, I like tea, toast and marmalade. For me. Toast and marmalade. That's for me. Toast and marmalade. And sugar when it's time for breakfast, I like tea, toast and marmalade. That's enough for me. That's enough for me. Child's the cup of tea. That's enough and a slice of that's deep brown bread. bread With milk and sugar If you have no bacon that's Then a the sausage me. will that's do enough instead me. One more time now oh, When I it's like time for breakfast I like bacon. toast and marmalade and slice Toast and marmalade bread. Toast and marmalade if When it's time for breakfast no I like bacon. toast and marmalade Then the sausage will do instead Just, Just a, a cup, cup of tea, tea. That's enough, enough for me, that's enough for me With milk and sugar, just a cup of tea That's enough for me, that's, that's enough, enough for me Egg and bacon everyone I like egg and bacon And a slice of thick brown bread If you have no bacon Then a sausage will do instead Bread
brilliant, ladies and gentlemen. Did you have fun? Indeed. I'm sorry, I can't oh. hear you. Did you enjoy that? Yes. Fantastic. Give yourselves, everybody Everyone. there, give yourselves a round, round of applause. Of applause. So there you are, everyone, a little potted history, the very, very early days of this channel where the world seemed, well, anything was possible as long as we all stuck together. And here we are two and a half years later with hundreds and hundreds of broadcasts. Uh, and I still think we've kept a lot of the spirit of those early sessions. As someone's just said in the comments, I think 2022, Ben, is less strung out than 2020, Ben. I think I'd agree, and I hope you would too. Great to see you all today, everyone. Do please stay safe, be well. We'll see you on Sunday. I hope you've enjoyed today. Do take care, everyone. All the best. Bye-bye.